Hi, this is Dr. Ruscio, and you've probably heard that the environment one grows up in has a strong influence on their immune system and the potential for autoimmunity. Well, a, published was, uh, a paper was recently published, excuse me, that looked at a group of children and tracked them from birth all the way through teenage years and tried to see if there was a correlation between the diversity of plant life uh, around which, where they grew up and any kind of atopic conditions of the skin, like skin autoimmunity, eczema, psoriasis, things like that. And very interestingly, they found that the more diverse and specifically the more wild the plant life was around one's uh, home when growing up had a direct impact on autoimmunity. But essentially what these authors showed was that the increased plant diversity, specifically wild type plants, so not plants that you just bought at a store and, and, and planted, but wild uh, vegetation had a correlation with increased bacterial diversity on the skin. That caused um, immunomodulation or an, an, an increase in anti-inflammatory compounds in the blood and that then caused decrease in skin atopic conditions. So. Uh, as we continue to learn more and more about this field, we're learning that an increasingly more sterile environment will cause malfunctions in the immune system. And here we see a nice illustration of that where we see when you have a very wild type environment, that fosters a high level of bacterial diversity in the skin in this case. That causes release of anti-inflammatory compounds that has an immune modulatory or immune balancing effect that then decreases atopic conditions of the skin. So, a very, very interesting study here. Um, again, I'll put up the, this cover slide here with a few notes that you may want to read through if you want a little bit more detail that you're seeing here. And then the second slide is a slide from the study essentially just showing what we just went over, which is uh, kind of this cascade of, of some of these events. So, takeaway here again is a little bit dirtier or a little bit di more diverse of an environment seems to be protective against autoimmunity of multiple forms and in this case we see evidence for that of skin autoimmunity. This is Dr. Ruscio and I hope you found this helpful. Thanks.